The Friendship Tree. Chapter 1. The Fantastic Trio. Once, in a small town, there were three best friends, Kylie, Zaire and Nyla. They had grown up in the same neighbourhood and formed a lifelong friend group. The trio spent their afternoons playing in the park, sharing laughter and building memories. Chapter 2. Omari's Arrival One day, a new kid named Omari moved into the neighbourhood. Amari mostly kept to himself, riding his bike in the park where Kylie, Zaire and Nyla played. Omari often felt left out and a bit sad, so he sat alone under a tree playing with his toys and watching the three friends from a distance. Chapter 3 The Unspoken Barrier Kylie felt sad that Amari was always playing by himself and she wanted to know how she could help him. Suddenly, Kylie had a great idea. She could talk to her mum. Kylie quickly ran over to her mum to ask how she could help Amari. Kylie's mum, full of wisdom and kindness, suggested, Why not invite him to play with you? That way you can get to know him. Remember the golden rule? Treat others the way you want to be treated. Chapter 4. The Golden Rule Kylie told her friends what her mum had shared with her. She was so excited to teach her friends of the golden rule. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Nyla and Zaire looked at each other and began to feel worried. What if he is different and doesn't like the same games we do? They wondered. Chapter 5. The Brave Invitation Despite her friend's reluctance, Kylie's mum encouraged her to be the change she wished to see. So, Kylie decided to do the right thing despite her fear of losing her friends. The next day, Kylie bravely approached Amari, introducing herself and inviting him to play. She was determined to show, not just tell her friends, how to be inclusive. However, this brave invitation challenged their friendship and made Nyla and Zaire feel betrayed. Chapter 6. The Ripple Effect One day, Omari noticed Zaire was playing alone. He suggested to Kylie, let's go and play with them. This small act of kindness started changing things and broke down the barriers that once stood. Later, after having a big think about it, Zaire and Nyla realised the importance of including everyone. They apologised to Kylie and Omari and together, the four friends embraced a new challenge, always inviting anyone left out in their friend group. Chapter 7. The Friendship Tree Flourishes Soon, Kids in Kylie, Zaire, Nyla and Amari's neighbourhood and even their school felt the warmth and inclusion and found a place to belong. The small town, once divided by unspoken barriers, now thrived with the laughter and joy of diverse friendships. The friendship tree, once limited to three branches, now flourished with vibrant colours of inclusion and kindness. The end.